everybody, I'm Caitlin and I work here at Little Bee Books and I'm going to share with you today some of our really great April releases. First up on the list is Buzzy Bee. This adorable board book has these beautiful bright colors, it's written by Emma Parrish, and little readers get to go through the story and actually find Buzzy Bee. So you start off in this really beautiful little field, where's Buzzy Bee? Is he flying near the pond? And readers will be able to put their finger in these little areas and slide up and slide over to seek for Busy Bee. The next two books I have on our list are from the author illustrator Jane Cabrera. These two books are really, really cute. The first one is called uh, Peekaboo You, and it's got these really great little cutouts here. You can have your little one put their eyeballs right in here and peekaboo at you. And as you go through, you just do things and read about all the little peekaboo things that a little kid does every day. So you have Peekaboo Baby, Peekaboo shoe. You can see baby's first shoes, the kitten is in there, and the little girl has her little first shoes on. Really fun, uh, you know, repeating refrain, perfect for little ones, and a great story time edition. The second one in that collection is Peekaboo Zoo, and you go through and you count animals, and you recognize animal colors and different animal names. So you have Peekaboo Baby, Peekaboo Two, because you have two pandas. And then Peekaboo Baby, Peekaboo Blue, because you have this really great blue parrot. And as you go through, you're just gonna meet more animals and have more situations like Peekaboo Roo, and even Peekaboo Ooh, like a monkey. And then at the very end, all of the animals that you've met throughout the title are there. The next two books I have to share with you are perfect for Father's Day, so cross off Get Daddy a Present on from your list because we have these here for you. I uh, Love You Daddy is for the younger reader, uh, perfect for toddlers giving presents to their daddies. We have this really great, it's a padded board book so it's nice and soft on the cover and then as you go through you find out all of the things that the little bear wants to do with his daddy for Father's Day. So you have the little bear drawing uh, pictures for him, um, picking apples, looking for tadpoles, even just having a good time in the backyard. The next one is what daddy's like, and this follows what we like to call the square bears and everything that they, they do with their daddies throughout the day. This one's really wonderful too because it's not that stereotypical daddy book that you have with trucks and cars and mud and dirt. It's smooches. It's pancakes in the morning. Adventures and swings all the actual things that you do with your daddy, which could involve trucks and mud and dirt and swings and things like that, but a lot of other things too, like monsters and roars and even some quiet time. Next up is, well, I'm not actually supposed to have favorites, but if I did have favorites, this would be my favorite, um, is Ready, Set, Build. Ready, Set, Build follows this little blue dog and his little green bird friend throughout a day where they actually make a playhouse for each other. The book is really great because it actually has sequencing too. So you're not just hearing them and watching them build their house, but you're actually watching them do it in the order in which it would normally be built. Sketch a dream, post a chart, hatch a plan before you start. So it really starts out at the very basic, you know, sit down, make a plan, make sure you have everything that you need. And then as you go through, move the rocks out of the way. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but I'm not certified to maneuver this backhoe, but this guy is and he's ready to go. All the little boys and girls are gonna love planning and drafting and creating and imagining everything that they can build just like dog and bird. The last two books I have to share with you come from our Blastback series, which is a really great chapter book series. It's nonfiction and it has a huge amount of genres and titles that we already have published, but the next two are Vikings and The Great Wall of China. I don't know about you, but I don't know much about either of these, so I was shocked when I found out that to build the Great Wall of China was actually started off as a form of punishment. That I had no idea. And that Vikings, well, they actually landed in North America before even Christopher Columbus. Another thing I had no idea about. These are filled with tons of those little known facts. They have timelines, glossaries, infographics, and the illustrations are actually hilarious. So it breaks up that nonfiction with some really well needed humor. I definitely would urge you to pick these up, give them a read, and just have a great time. That's it for me today. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to our channel to make sure that you can check out all of the other great titles that we have coming out month by month. We're hosting a giveaway for all of the great titles that you saw today, so make sure you leave a comment below on which one was your favorite. Good luck!